the Lobster New Year Association. This is one of the oldest comic clubs in the parade. 35-year-old Justin Myers, an architect, one of the young new leaders of the 108-year-old club. I'm like, hey guys, this is a good time. Uh, celebrate this like city's tradition. Fabricator and designer Joseph Campbell also feels connected. My grandfather, and then uh, from my understanding, a few of, of you know his brothers are, you know, but never really met them. So <laughs> my dad was a mummer. My godfather was a mummer, and uh, it means a lot. This is something the neighborhood thing. We want to keep going. Joe's uncle, Mike D'Imperio, the historian of the Lobster New Year Association, says it often served as a social club. Hundreds of social members. Barney Samuels was a mayor in 1940s. He was right around the corner. And uh, he even used to come in here. And the books we have from the 1920s is, it says refreshments. So Sundays and Saturdays, every day they're here, there was beer here. The Lobster Club gained followers in the 1920s during Prohibition when it was learned that it served, well, refreshments. D'Imperio has unlocked much of the lobster's past. The flag from the first parade, the original charter, and that the lobster name had less to do with crustaceans and more with complexion. They were five guys who were Irish and German, and one of the guys said they look like lobsters because of their ruddy red complexions. So they called themselves lobsters. D'Imperio curates photos from the mid-20th century and earlier, including women supporters known as the Garter Girls in 1932. Now, about 50% of parading members are women. The club had remained open through the 20th century, but had not paraded for more than 40 years before returning in 2014, thanks to younger, theatrical, and politically edgy members. We have a saying, we have a chance, like Red Claw Outlaw. We're a group of creative individuals, mostly from the Fishtown area. We primarily communicate through Facebook. But among the traditions that remain, a love of the Mummers Parade. It's just a great day. It's like the best day of the year. On Porter Street in South Philadelphia, I'm Steve Heisman.